the Joe Rogan experience. Look at that. Mm. Wow. In addition to mammals, cats kill an, addition, uh, an estimated 377 million birds and 649 million reptiles every year in Australia. That's fucking nuts. Far out. Yeah. Some and blowout. some asshole brought them over there not that long ago. Mm. I think they brought them over in the 1800s. Yeah, I've heard like a couple of uh, different like yeah. cases where that they bring people in. Is that what it says? Yeah. Some and then it just went backwards for them. Yeah, you can't just bring things places. You can't just do yeah. that, you know? <laughs> well, Especially that, predators. Or the cane toads. So they got introduced for, I oh, can't, man, I know you might have to get this one, but they, they bring them in and now they're just a complete uh, like pest, like they're, they're like up Those and are big fuckers, yeah, aren't they? Yeah, they're big. What they bring them here for? Probably for some other stupid reason. I can't remember. Yeah, I can't remember Get what rid it was. Of the flies. Too and many mosquitoes. Yeah, close beetles in the sugar fields. Yeah, there you go. Too yeah. many beetles. What do you want to do? Yeah, you bring them, <laughs> and now, now they're like a massive problem, you know what I mean? So, 1935, these dipshits. They were brought to Australia from Hawaii with the intention of controlling the cane beetle in the sugar cane fields in uh, North Queensland. Cane beetles live on the high upper stalks of the cane plant. Cane toads can't jump up that far, so they barely had any impact. These fucking idiots. They didn't know jack shit in 1935. They couldn't Wikipedia shit, right? Some some idiots like, uh, you got to justify your job. Uh, toads. We're going to bring toads. Okay. <laughs> Have we talked about the four pest campaign that happened? Whoa, look at the size of that prick. Look at the one in the middle. Click on that one in the middle, the, the, the middle oh, picture. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, that's a person. I didn't there. realize that was a person. Look at that. <laughs> Look at those fucks. Yeah, man. Jesus Christ. Well, they started off they were, they were all up they were up north in like Queensland and then they just now they now they are all in uh, New South Wales and they're just expanding. It's just like going to take over Australia. So mm, I don't even great. know actually. This is this is the stats that I knew about like 8 years ago. So it's probably quadrupled by now or like they probably have covered the, all of probably. Australia. I don't even know. What do they use to kill the cane toads? They're going to bring in birds. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, what kills? Is, have we talked about the four pest campaign? That's like a ancient, not ancient, but like it's a historical event that happened that led to like the death of 35 million people in China. No. Yeah, they had a sparrow problem, or swallows, <laughs> whichever, with small bird. Mm -hmm. So they were they were an annoyance that they allowed people to kill them, or like bang pots and pans to get rid of them. That worked to get rid of them, but then all of the bugs then ate all the rice fields. That led to a famine. That led to 25 to 35 million people dying. Oh, jeez. Like years later, yeah. So it would have been better off with the birds. Yeah, when, when so it's like a whole, it's a historical event that people need to keep in mind when these things happen that there's a very sensitive ecosystem. Yeah. Was that in 1935 as well? When we <laughs> <got> <laughs> it actually was at the same time period. <laughs> it's too really bad, yeah. Nobody learned. <laughs> yeah, it's man. like, I don't know, man. I don't know how they're going to get rid of those frogs. Do they have an idea? I don't know. Like, uh, man, I don't know too much. I just remember hearing that stats off thought I'd throw it out there. But well, I don't know. It's bloody, I think, it, oh, man, I remember seeing videos of it and there was like just the floors absolutely covered of, in certain spots up in Queensland, like absolutely covered. Like, Actually, it was in The Simpsons, wasn't it? Was it? I swear <laughs> it was a Simpsons episode. Yeah, the... What is it? I would have called them shaz or something like that. Some, I remember, yeah, someone comes, they beat them. They like, uh, they pull out the sticks and beat yeah, their bats yeah. or something like that. Yeah. The four pest thing was a couple of years later. It's 1958 to 1962. Mm, interesting. 1960. So they didn't learn from 35. <laughs> well, maybe those toads taste good. Maybe they should start eating toads. I think frog legs are delicious. Are they poisonous? No. Oh, no. boy. I don't know. I don't that's even. a problem. Yeah, that's <laughs> why I think they're a big one. Oh, no, maybe not. Maybe not. Are cane toads poisonous? We'll find out here. As, have you ever had frog legs? Uh, oh, yes, I have. Well, they're cooked well. Did, they're good. I, where did I have that? I did have that, and it was actually what was it? It was actually a mixture of I thought chicken and fish, the ones I had. Yeah, is similar. That, is yeah, that, is that similar? A, you reckon? Or? Yeah, but they always say everything poisonous, tastes like chicken. but no one's mm. died from that. Oh, it, well, okay. Sometimes you get sick. They have boiled toad eggs. Oh, oh boy, toad eggs. Jesus. Well, Okay. So their vent, they have some sort of poison. It says, yeah, their cane toad has poison glands through their whole life cycle. Mm. Depends on when it's killed. Depends on what. What you about eat. for animals? Uh, they yeah, it, it kills. Yeah, it's bad for animals. Bad okay. for dogs. Oh well, that's great. That means you can't eat them. That means these fuckers they're running around making sure that predators don't eat them. No frog legs poison. in what Australia. What a dumb animal to bring over there to kill beetles. You fucking <laughs> assholes. You should find that guy from 1935 and kick his ass. We go back in time. <laughs> like, what were you thinking, man? What a dumb move. Wait, Bring over a poison toad that no one can eat. <laughs> <laughs> what was it, so what was it for bugs? So literally for bugs. That's so crazy. Yeah, and the fact that it's poisonous, which n not venomous, poisonous, which means if they eat it, they die. 
So these predators, if you brought over a bunch of fucking jackals or something to go eat the frogs yeah. or the toads, they would wind <laughs> up dying. Cane toads, oh, they do have venom secreting poison glands known as paratoid glands or swellings on each shoulder where poison is released if they are threatened, when they are threatened. If ingested, the venom can cause rapid heartbeat, excessive salivation, convulsions, and paralysis and can result in death for many native animals. Great. <laughs> <laughs> so you can't even fucking kill them with predators. God, it's a, well, maybe we can get the cats to eat the cane toads. Maybe that's the move. I swear, like, uh, I could be wrong. Like, the most, look at this, the <laughs> most humane way to kill cane toads is to put them in the freezer alive. Humane? <laughs> that's the most I, humane? Well, my, I've got, I think I remember getting told, like, that you, well, back in the day, like, you, you had to kill them if you seen them or something like that. Oh, I, think I that imagine. Was, I think that was a kill them if you can. The once popular method was used to kill millions of poisonous pets until it was banned 20 years ago because animal ethics committees considered it inhumane. Oh, you fucks. It's all those fucking animal rights people. They ruin everything. What about our rights? Huh? You got poison toads everywhere, assholes. How do you get rid of them? What does it say? Remove toad temptations and make your home a cane toad free zone. You need a sign. You decide, hey, we're a cane toad free zone here. <laughs> Cover or bring pet food in at night as it attracts cane toads. Remove standing water. Oh, great. How are you going to do that? What's, what about ponds? What about puddles? Remove rubbish and other degrees, debris so the cane toad cannot shelter under it during the day. Keep your outside <laughs> lights off when not needed. Keep toads out by creating a barrier. Far out. Far out indeed. I don't know about that. It's like a fence if they can't jump that high. <laughs> Just hire people. Hire people to kill them. Give them a lot. Make it valuable to kill them. I'm telling you, I think it was for a bit. I think they were, they were honestly, I remember if you see one, like I think you, you had to. I don't know. You're supposed to kill them? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I could be wrong. Maybe I just heard that from someone and I'm it running would be with it. Good archery practice if you had a lot of arrows, you know, because it's yeah. not a big target. It's a good thing to shoot at. <laughs> Fucking crazy assholes. Bring over fucking poisonous toads. Estimated over 200 million. No. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, yeah That's they've... so crazy. That's so many toads. <laughs> 200 million toads? Man. Jesus, Australia. Yeah, I don't know about that one. Crazy. <laughs>